George, Charlotte and Louis could meet Lilibet soon after a major hint. Prince Charles appeared to drop a major hint Prince George, Charlotte and Louis may soon meet their cousin Lilibet during his recent trip to Jordan. The Duke and Duchess of Cornwall arrived in Jordan on Tuesday for a visit to the country. They had originally planned to travel there in March 2020, however, the trip was postponed due to the pandemic. During a trip to the River Jordan, Prince Charles was captured collecting holy water traditionally used at royal christenings. Director General of the Baptism Site, Rustam Gian, spoke to the Telegraph about the lifting of this water. He said, it is pure water blessed from the spot where Jesus was baptized. It is holy and blessed from this particular spot in the Hashemite Kingdom of Jordan. As well as this, according to the Daily Mail, the Director General confirmed the water would be used for future baptisms. But the past year has been filled with births in the royal family, with the Queen seeing four new great-grandchildren being born. Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooks Fink brought a boy into the world in February called August Philip Hawk. Zara and Mike Tyndall gave birth to Lucas Philip in March, with the Duke and Duchess of Sussex welcoming Lilibet Diana in June. The last of the four new arrivals came in September as Princess Beatrice and Eduardo Mapley welcomed C and Elizabeth into the world. Due to Covid restrictions in place, the four of Her Majesty's great-grandchildren have been unable to have traditional royal christenings but could do in the coming months. While Harry and Meghan are based in the USA with their daughter Lilibet there are hopes they could travel to Britain to have her christened at Windsor as her brother Archie was not long after his birth in 2019. If the Sussexes do come back to the UK for the family event then it may be the first time Prince George, Louis, Charlotte and Lilibet get to meet. While last year saw the Queen dramatically pare back her traditional Christmas celebrations there are high hopes the royal gathering will return this year with family members flocking to Sandringham for the holiday. Royal pundit Nicholas Witchell explained how the royal family were preparing for a normal Christmas, much different to last year's. Mr Witchell said, so by light duties, they mean essentially desk-based work, but she will also be continuing with other video audiences. And indeed there was another audience this morning with another senior military officer, which was done by video rather than face to face. So all those functions, important functions that the head of state carries out will be carried on. The number of documents that she has to read, the things that she has to sign, you know, we shouldn't forget that she's not only head of state of the United Kingdom, but of 15 other territories and countries around the world. So there is quite a heavy workload so those duties will continue. We're a month away from Christmas. I think it's too early to say what's going to happen then, but she and the rest of the family will no doubt be hoping that it will be Christmas pretty much as normal.